okay now we are going to see find the quotient use repeated subtraction you know that repeated subtracted sorry repeated subtraction otherwise we can call it as division so now we are going to see five how many five s are there in 30 so 30 is a what dividend so we are going to subtract with what five so repeated subtraction otherwise we can call it as division okay now we are going to use the repeated subtraction and finally i'll tell you how to what how to do the division okay 30 minus 5 you can get what that is 25 okay you know that 30 30 minus 5 so what you'll get so 10 0 minus 5 you can't so the 0 is not enough to subtract so you have to borrow from 110 okay so this 0 become 10 10 minus 5 you can get 5 so this 3 become 2 the answer is 25 so now again 25 minus 5 you can get so 25 minus 5 you know that 0 and 2 again so now 20 minus 5 so again 20 going to subtract minus okay 5 so 20 is going to subtract with 5 so again 0 is not enough to subtract so you have to borrow from 1 so this 0 become 10 10 minus 5 you know that backward counting again so 5 means after 5 6 7 8 9 10 so you can get again 5 so this 2 become 1 because you you borrow from 110 here so from from 2 you have to borrow already you have borrowed that is here two tens you, you have borrowed one ten so that is what it becomes after this it becomes what one so the answer is 15 now so again 15 minus 5 so 5 minus 5 0 and 1 you have to write again so what is this 10 so 10 minus 5 so you know that very well 10 minus 5 0 is not enough to subtract because it's ones and tens so you have to borrow from what 110 so from 110 to 110 so this 0 become what 10 10 minus 5 you can get 5 so you have already borrowed from it's here only 110 so you have already borrowed 110 so it becomes what 0 so no need to write it here so 10 minus 5 you can get 5 also so what is the number so how many 5s are there in 30 so look at this 1 2 3 4 5 and again so 5 is the last number again 5 minus 5 you get you can get up to 5 I've done it so again you have to 5 minus 5 you have to do it because first 30 minus 5 you can get 25 25 minus 5 you can get 20 20 minus 5 you can get 15 15 minus 5 you can get 10 and 10 minus 5 you can get 5 so you don't uh, what uh, don't uh, stop up to 5 because you can get 0 because 0 is the last number so up to 0 you have to do it so 5 minus 5 you know that very well 5 minus 5 so you can get 0 because 5 chocolate is there 5 5 so you have you what if you borrow 5 again you can get only 0 only so 5 minus 5 0 so you have to find out how many 5 years are there in 30 so what is this 1 2 3 4 5 6 so how many fives are there that is how many five is how many five yes otherwise fives are there that is what right exactly fives are there that is six fives okay what is the answer how many fives are there in 30 means there are there are so this is the only thing you have to consider you have to consider this i i showed in some other color Now you differentiate, I think so. There are how many phi's are there? Six. Okay. There are six phi's are there. Six phi's are the six phi's are there are six phi's in 30. What is the answer? Six. Answer is six. So this is what repeated subtraction repeated subtraction otherwise called as what division so now we are going to divide 30 30 is divided by 5 means look at this so this is a dividend and this is a divisor you know that 
so 30 means you have to what first you have to compare with 3 3 is less than 5 so you have to take the next number 3 0 that is 30 so 30 is going to divide by 5 so you must use the 5 table so 5 ones are 5 5 twos are 10 5 threes are 15 5 fours are 20 5 fours are 25 5 six are 30 so you have to write it here 6 so 30 minus 30 again we can get what 0 so this is a quotient and this is a reminder so the answer is 6 so this is repeated subtraction this is division okay division sorry this is division otherwise division is otherwise called as what repeated what repeated subtraction repeated subtraction so division otherwise called as repeated subtraction so this is a we used only repeated subtraction and find out the quotient so how many five is are there mean there are six five is in 30 there are six five is in 30 six five is in 30 that is six is a quotient that is what six is a quotient so the answer is quotient we'll find out the answer is six is the right answer so repeated subtraction otherwise called as division so i use division method and also repeated subtraction but you have to find out the answer only in repeated subtraction but anyhow i i i have done it division also for you so the answer is one two three four five what six six fives in 30 there are six fives in 30 so we have to find out the quotient the quotient is six even in repeated subtraction and also in division so both you can do but i uh, actually you have to use only repeated subtraction because the question they are given only repeated subtraction but even you can do in both method repeated subtraction otherwise called as division so even you can do repeated subtraction as well as division if you take both method also you can get the answer is that is quotient is 6 there is no doubt